What's going on, guys? Tomix back here in our video. Uh, you know, another searching video. I'm just kind of interested. On, uh, I want to find out what is the longest English word in the entire English language. I don't know. I don't know, actually. Like, I, I don't know. The only thing that I know is, like, maybe it's a science word. I don't know, because... Scientific words are usually very massive, so, uh, yeah. So, let's go and search to Google. I already have the longest word in English. And, uh, let's see what will happen here. Three, two, one. Okay. The, the internet connection here is low-key very slow. Uh, and... Come on, I want to see. The internet is... Oh. Oh. My. Gosh. What is that? Like, what? What is that? Uh, what? Uh, I can't. I can't read that. Who, guys, let me know in the comments down below. Can you read that? Uh, forty-five letters is a lung disease caused by inhalation of silica and quartz dust. Wow! I knew it. It's like a medical word or something. Uh, guys, I'm so. I don't know if I'm gonna uh, pronounce this right, but I'm just gonna try, okay? It's called uh, Pneumono Ultra Microscopic Silica Volcano Kinosis. What? <laughs> what is that? Wait, what? It's Pneumono Ultra Microscopic Silica Volcano Kinosis. Wow. So now. It's a very short video, but now you know that that's the longest word in English. It's a scientific word that only scientists, crazy scientists, all they use, guys. So, yeah, it's a very short video. You know, I'm just kind of interested, and I thought it would be a good idea if I record it. So, yeah. Goodbye. See you in the next video, maybe tomorrow or a day after. But, yeah. John Max, peace out. Bye!